Hello, my name is Panagolis Andreu, and in today's vlogs, I'm going to give a brief explanation on what strike is, refer to some types of strikes, and lastly, I will give some solution on how manager can prevent strikes from happening. To start with, strike is the mutual refusal by workers to work under the terms requested by employers. Strikes are the main form of a conflict in an organization. The first and most common types of strike is the economic one. During this form of a strike, labor ceases working to implement their economic conditions, such as salaries and bonuses. One recent example regarding this type of strike is the Amazon employee strike that held in March 2020 in the United States. Employees were asking from the company to provide them with their pay until April fails due to COVID-19 pandemic. In advance, sympathetic strike is when products can be triggered by sympathy with other striking workers. For example, members in the other union should take part in a strike to support or demonstrate their solidarity for members of trade unions that are on a strike in other undertakings. Another form of a strike is the sit-down strike. In this scenario, workers are not away from their place of employment while they are st striking. They retain charge of the manufacturing plants but don't do any jobs. The attraction of the technique is that it stops bosses from replacing them with strike breakers or withdrawing machinery for switching manufacturing to other location. Moving on, there are many solutions and steps that could be taken by organization to prevent strikes from happening. Firstly, companies could enable the autonomy of workers. Autonomy means empowering workers to influence their job environment in such a way that they can succeed to the best of their abilities. For instance, choose their uniform styles, working schedule, and etc. Therefore, another result to the problem is for companies to consider the well-being of their employees. Staff who see their bosses do everything in the power to keep employees safe and secure feel more respected than the workers who see signs that they are on the wrong side of the cost-benefit equation. Finally, as we discussed in the live seminars, employers can form an agreement with trade union known as collective bargaining to regulate employee salaries, benefits, and working conditions. As a result, employees will feel more powerful. Thanks for watching.